Welcome back to the channel and of course you're here checking in again with our daily PGV update. So according to Manny's old statements all of the refunds should have been sent by now because of course we have gone past May 12th. Of course that one has not happened yet however we have some news today but before we get any further remember that nothing in this video is financial advice. Just treat this as entertainment at this point, and you should always do your own research regarding anything in the crypto space. So, in terms of announcements, we've had three new posts from Manny. We had a post yesterday evening saying, Hey everyone, just giving everyone an update. This evening, liquidity will be available to start sending out refunds. Originally, it was expected early, but will be ready this evening. It is currently 10 a.m. Pacific time, Friday, May. 12. We're not sure exactly how long it will take us to fully complete all refunds as there is no way to be sure considering we're doing them manually but they will start going out this evening for sure once liquidity is available and we will continue until we are done. And then we had a post four hours later. Okay everyone refunds will start going out between 9pm and 10pm at Pacific time today May 12th. Then we will continue the refund process into tomorrow and have all refunds fully complete by Sunday, May 14th, Pacific time. We want to thank you all for your patience. This will be a great weekend for everyone. And then, of course, we had a post this morning. Good news. We have received the liquidity. Later than expected, but received. We expect to be receiving it in tokens needed to do the refunds, but we have received in ETH, ERC20. Due to the token receiving in Ethereum, we will be exchanging it all for USDT, uh, Binance, uh, BET20, USDT, BET20, BUSD, BET20, so the free coins for the Binance Smart Chain, Matic, Polygon, DAI, all token needed for the refund. After looking at the best way to do this, including the time this processing will take anywhere from 6 to 12 hours, we are starting the process now, so within 6 to 12 hours, we'll be getting the refund process going. Thanks again for your patience. We are almost there. Again, we are sending manually, so we don't have any further issues or delays. Not taking any risks. We'll be start on track getting them done by Sunday, May 14th. So, what I'm seeing here is reused excuses with now the claiming of having liquidity. Let me know your thoughts. But, by the looks of it, first off, didn't many have, well, claim to have the liquidity and all the funds ready last week? And the week before and the week before but now again he said he has secured more liquidity received in ethereum and now he just needs to swap the tokens and we know this process he tries to swap the tokens it takes a two more days of delay once the tokens are swapped then he's going to try and use another mixer again then that's going to be another four days of delay and then he's probably going to need to get a new liquidity or something we're repeating this cycle over and over again at what point is he either just going to send some refunds or just admit that the funds are gone or some legal stuff happens because at this point we're going around in circles for people who are still having hope announcement and announcement don't get your hopes up really just if you've watched the videos for the past week the past months you know what we've been going through it's um yeah pretty ridiculous we'll see well he said six to twelve hours for the swap it has already been six hours at the time of me recording this. By the time this video is out, it would be around 10 hours. So pretty much after this video goes out, in a couple hours, you might get another announcement from Manny. But tomorrow, we'll check in to see if any refunds get sent. My um, guess slash prediction is there won't be any sent tomorrow. But we'll see. Who knows? But yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you all have a good weekend and I'll see you soon.